Thank you. 
Thanks for everyone for coming to this second of our five um, array 50th anniversary concerts. So this one, um, as you all know, obviously is a portrait of um, array's longest um, serving artistic director, Michael Baker. Baker. Um, and it is lovely to have this program happening uh, curated, by, curated by Marie Jose. And um, it's been a really fun thing. For, this whole season has been incredibly fun for me to program. It's been fun to dig back through the archives. Of, of so many of you were here last week and saw a lot of things from the first 20 years of the, of the, of the of array. This concert sort of represents roughly like a roughly 10 year period that was Michael's, Michael's era, essentially. So roughly 1992 to 2000, actually. So um, this concert um, has a bunch of really fun music as you see. And um, I don't know what else to say. I think Marie Jose is going to talk some more about, about a bit of music uh, later on. Um, meanwhile, I um, need to acknowledge that every music operates on ancient land. Land that has seen and supported humanity for 15,000 years. It's the land of the Green First Nations, the Seneca, and more recently, the Mississaugas of the Credit First Nations. The land is subject to the District Form Scheme and Wampum Valley Covenant. An agreement with the Human Anishinaabek Nation and the Haudenosaunee Confederacy, excuse me, Confederacy to peaceably share and care for the resources of the region. Today, Toronto remains a meeting place and is home to indigenous peoples from across the world. Thank you again for coming. Um, I want to thank, I mean, there's so many people to thank, um, from, from Marie, Marie Jose to Sandra Bell to her staff to Dan Lane, who are who are running tech back, back there to the band to us to our, our, our the funders, the Canada Council for the Arts, the Toronto Arts Council, the Ontario Arts Council, um, various foundations, lots of individual donors. It's, um, it's, been, it's been quite a labor, labor of love to put together this season, and, and I'm excited to have all of you around for it. Um, there's one other thing. So back by the bar, um, which we are, we are, rather than buy alcohol, what I want you all to do is put money in the red box, um, which is um, all going to be given to Stephen Clark. I raised a long time pianist, um, as many of you know, um, is currently undergoing sort of treatment for uh, fairly advanced cancer, and he will not be able to join us for probably the whole season. Um, hopefully, hopefully he'll be back in the spring, but we don't know. So meanwhile, um, we're all trying to do as much as we can to help out. So if everyone can please, please, please put something in the box. There is also an online fundraiser, which has more serious, sort of serious, <laughs> serious money than, than that. So if you want to give more, I would very much encourage you to find some cards to a fund me. Um, it's on a raise, uh, on a raise email, on a raise um, um, Facebook page and all that kind of thing. So um, Stephen's an incredibly important member of our community and we really, we really want to fund as much as we can, uh, as much as we can during, during the time he needs. So um, I think, Without further ado, we're going to let Beavis play this really fantastic little piece that I'm thrilled that I don't have. <laughs> <laughs>
enough time for us to move some of the crap around and get set up for the next half. And we're looking forward to uh, the rest. Thank you.
colleagues and family members, high school friend, I'm not pointing anywhere. We have a, a beautiful uh, a collection of fantastic people and some new people for us to are introduced to my first music for the first time. Um, I would like to welcome people at home on the live stream with your popcorn and your drinks. Um, there are people from across Canada, I think, well, some I know, uh, watching tonight, uh, some family members that are in Alberta and good old friends that are in British Columbia, everywhere, and maybe even in Ireland. Um, so welcome. I would also like to uh, thank uh, David and Rick and collaborating to put this uh, program together. Of course, I have some ideas. So <laughs> and uh, it was really wonderful to collaborate on this program. Uh, I'd like also to thank Sam Bell. Um, you see the souvenir program. Uh, this, I mean, yes. Thank you. There's also one, uh, some of them from last week's concert. I would encourage you to grab them too. Um, it's really beautiful. There's so much um, beautiful information about all the pieces you heard tonight. Uh, as you know, Michael loves writing for dance as well. So the first piece I made in shorts, uh, Christopher House choreographed to that piece for the company from our dance theater. The last piece we're going to hear tonight, Columbus, uh, James Godalka choreographed. Uh, this piece was called CD. CD. Um, so there's a lot of information. I'm not going to tell you because you can read about it. Make sure you get a program. Uh, mm, I'm in the way. There's lots of time. They're redesigning the space. <laughs> um, many of the musicians tonight uh, never played Michael's music. So uh, I love that. That's a really nice uh, introduction, new ear. Um, uh, be this on and played the marimba solo that was written for Rick Sack, uh, the Waldo. You'll see the program is played with or without electronics. So I met uh, Beavis in, in June. I'm a part of the faculty in Banff at the Evolution Classical. And uh, we work with 27 musicians from all over North America. And Beavis with uh, partner in crime, Poi Tong. We have a beautiful duo called a Kong Duo. Correct me if I'm wrong. And the teacher Aylun is on faculty also. Um, so that's where I met uh, and, uh, a fantastic group of uh, emerging uh, musicians. And uh, when I was dreaming up this program, I thought, oh, the Waldo, let's see. And so, uh, so that's how we, uh, that's how we have new generation and new ears to Michael Jesus. You almost done? No. <laughs> no. Take your time. I still have. Take your time. We have CDs on the table, uh, so uh, all the pieces you heard tonight are on those CDs, so the big pictures is a, was a big multidisciplinary work that Michael created with Bill James as choreographer and Dan Solomon as painter, and I was in there as a dancer. So the face of the twins, the twins was part of this uh, piece. Uh, you have Ten Planets by Rick Sachs. Uh, you have two versions of the Waldo that is part of those CDs. And uh, In Paradisum, which includes uh, animated shorts and colors and, and In Paradisum, of course. So they're free, you should still use CDs. Go there. And last. <laughs> Last, make sure you stay after uh, so that you have little treats and then you can meet uh, in here. And I'm going to sit down and you can take a touch I'll time. Just a moment. No rush. <laughs>